And how can we make sure that everybody feels safe, right? We want Orange County to be the safe place for everybody to, to live, to work, and to enjoy. Domestic violence takes way too many lives every year, and the solutions are not simple. But Orange County is tracking it in a brand new way. West Tuzanica Hope reports there's now funding for a child care program that may help victims leave their abusers. On the outside, the choice to leave someone who is abusive can seem obvious. But Dr. Tracy Salem, the deputy director for Orange County Community and Family Services, says it's often about a lot more, like money. The mother will remain in the household because they can't afford to leave. That is what Orange County learned about families struggling here from the Citizen Safety Task Force and the Domestic Violence Task Force. And what we found in Orange County was one of the biggest um, barriers or obstacles is child care. Child care is very costly. Um, child care is an expense that a lot of our families have to incur. So they came up with an idea, provide child care to domestic violence survivors with children up to 12 years old. We're working with several different domestic violence partners and programs in the community, and they will identify the families. Tuesday, the Orange County Board of County Commissioners approved $1 million to fund a pilot program for two years. So the money won't travel necessarily through the family, the money will be provided directly to the service provider. They will also collaborate with Orange County's neighborhood centers for families to identify any other needs for the survivor and their family. That there's a safety net and we really need to make sure that we're providing that and that safety net is going to look different for everybody. And if they see real results, the pilot could become permanent. Anika Hope, West 2 News.